Hey y'all and welcome back. If you're new here, you're welcome to be here. This is what I'm cooking for dinner tonight. I'm cooking some smoked turkey tails in a crock pot. Y'all know I love my crock pot, baby. I-, I can't let it go. So what I did was I filled it half with water. I dropped my turkey tails over in there. I added lemon pepper, garlic powder, crushed red peppers, a sasson pack. Don't forget to add your black pepper. And then I fill the water. Make sure the meat is submerged in the water. Put the lid on. Turn it on high, y'all. Let it cook for about four hours. I did four hours and 20 minutes, and I'll tell you why. So as you can see, they're falling apart right in front of your eyes. Like, what? Meat tender and juicy, y'all. Can't go wrong. Can't go wrong. And I'm going to say it again. We cannot go wrong in the crock pot. Make sure you dip all your meat out. Now, it goes good with beans, any type of beans, black eyed peas, pinto beans, even lima beans, y'all. But I chose to use the egg noodles. All right, y'all. So with the amount of broth that I have, I'm going to allow it to cook for one hour. I did put the whole pack in there and I submerged them down. Look at the fluffiness, y'all. I can't wait to taste it. Oh, my God. So then I put my meat back in there because I need the temperature. I need my meat to be hot and warm so, you know, I don't have to drop it in the microwave because we ain't here for that, y'all, right? And then we're going to plate it up. Y'all, look at this. Let me just take a moment of silence for this deliciousness that's about to go in my mouth and hubby mouth. Y'all, if you have not tried this, you should. And that's some Walmart cornbread. I told y'all about the sweet cornbread, y'all. Please check it out because it's well worth it. And it helps uh, create an easier step in the kitchen, y'all. But I thank y'all for watching. Stay tuned for my next video.